Hey guys, here we are. Um, this is, I've seen this floor plan before and uh, a lot of people like it. These are really large houses. They're on a bit of smaller lots, but they can be more or like low maintenance for you um, in regard to the lot. Um, there's the school down the street right there. Uh, so that's actually kind of cool. Um, so it's in walking distance to the house. Uh, looking at the outside, it looks good. You know, I'm not seeing anything major um, that is popping out to me so far. Um, here's the neighborhood here. You know, got some really pretty lawns. It's a beautiful neighborhood. There's a park down there. You can see there's some people walking right there. So uh, location-wise, it's good. It does have a view fence in the back. Um, so the lot's not anything like the other lot that we were in. Um, so anyway, wait, let's go ahead and walk through here. This is uh, the one car garage right here. You could convert it into a casita if you wanted to, and then the two cars directly in front of you. Um, so here is the one car garage. I am noticing <coughs> the windows do have seal pops on them. So it's not that it'll affect you any, but if you eventually want to replace those, you know, because of the aesthetics of them, you'll have to do that. Um, they have all kinds of inlaid lighting here uh, pulling up, which is kind of cool. I am noticing there is a broken glass here on the, um, I don't think you're going to be able to see this, but it's right there. Yeah, there you go. I can see the crack a little. Uh, for right now, the roof looks like it's actually in good shape from here, from this point. I'm not seeing anything that is, you know freaking me out and this is really big you know courtyard area here <clears throat> let's do a little panoramic view for you I've got little palms here kind of cute okay all right we're gonna go ahead and enter the home there's this is actually not the entryway but they had that door locked so I'm just going to take you in through here and this is what the family room is here where you would put your TV and um, as you can see uh, the carpet's in good shape it looks like it's actually pretty pretty new I would say it is new um, you got huge picture windows now we don't have any window coverings um, so you know there are a lot of windows you're gonna have to think about that. So anyway, um, they do have granite in the kitchen, which I am sure you are aware of already. It looks like they've got some new appliances in here. They don't have a refrigerator in here, so that would be something that you wanna think about. Um, nice island kitchen. And uh, that's, that's pretty nice to be able to put your seats under there. They look like they have a walk-in pantry. It's a good size. Uh, and then here's the eating kitchen here. Okay, so this is the view from your kitchen looking out. Uh, here's the formal dining room, which is nice because it goes out, looks over into the courtyard once again. We don't have any window coverings, so. Um, and uh, you just wanna think about those things. Got the laundry room right by the, uh, right by the kitchen. So kitchen and laundry right next to each other. Good size. Uh, and here it looks like they have a uh, little separate area so you can store um, some, you know, the things that you need for laundry. Nice coffered ceilings. So this would actually be the entry here. So here's the entry door, okay? You'd walk in through here, whoever's coming to visit. And then you've got like more of like a formal sitting room in here or the pool table room, which would look real nice, but uh, no window coverings once again. So that's something that you'll have to figure out. Okay, I am gonna actually go upstairs next, which this is pretty nice. I like the glass block on here. That's pretty dramatic. I like that. Uh, this carpet doesn't look like it's new, um, but it's in okay shape. 
yeah, it, it's definitely not new, but it looks decent. So I think you should be fine with that. Let me take a look back here. We walk up and here's a bathroom in here. Give you an idea. Does have the separate potty room in there, so that's good. The door and a bathtub, so that's good. Tile on the floor. Here is one of the rooms. Really good size room, actually. I would say this has B11 by 13, maybe. Um, so good size. And then they have the little seating area over there. And a walk-in closet, so that's nice. Okay, let's head over to the next bedroom. This one is also pretty good size, a little smaller than the other one. It's kind of hard to see in here. I'm gonna say about 10 by 12. Um, once again, they have a nice little walk-in closet. I know it's hard to see. There's really not much to see, so you don't have to worry about missing anything. So here's the view from the, um, from this bedroom here, and then you walk down that hallway. And then here's the view downstairs. Pretty nice. Okay, now I'm walking down the hallway here, and we are really nice uh, entry to the master bedroom. And it looks like we've got another room here. It's nice, good colors. You're not gonna have to paint anything, so you don't have to stress about that. Um, just a traditional closet there, okay? And then we also have one on this side. Same bedroom, pretty much. Traditional closet. Really good size rooms in this house. Really good size rooms. So, okay, let's get to the important part, which is the master. It has a really nice entry, as you can see. Coffered ceilings. Um, let me see if I can get some lights on in here. Yeah, looks nice, looks pretty. And then we're gonna go over to the left here, and this is where you have your bathroom, your master bathroom. It does have double sinks, and it has a pantry. And here is the shower, has a little seat in there, that's kind of cool. Looks like there's a crack in the shower, so that's something that will have to be replaced. I'll just try to zoom in on that. And I don't know if I can. Yeah, so that's that's what the deal is with that. That'll probably have to be sealed or replaced. Has a jetted tub. And a little makeup mirror. Yeah, there we go. Good view. And then this is the walk-in closet over here. Really good size. Very nice. Yeah, goes kind of back here, and there we go. Looks good, very nice, and okay. So you do have a little patio off the master. I'm gonna open this up. Here we go, and then here's the master bedroom. The master bedroom is long, so I'm assuming your bed would go here, and then your TV would go here on this wall. So it's wide though, it's wide enough for plenty of, of furniture. Let's go ahead and go outside on the patio here. This looks like it's in fine shape, the patio, covered patio. And um, this uh, backs to a beautiful open space back there. So um, here is the backyard. Um, these yards are long uh, versus deep, okay, so they're they're wide versus deep. There's, there's what the neighbors look like. I know everybody likes to see what the neighbors look like. So they're not bad. They got some cool stuff over there. Um, so yeah, this is what it, it pretty much looks like. And I'll go downstairs now.